Deep Excav Soldier Pile Wall with the use of shortcrete wall beams. Part 2. In part 1, we created a 3.05 meters excavation on the right side of a soldier pile wall. In this part, we will also include shortcrete wall beams. First of all, we go to the design sections area. We right click on the mouse and we choose to change the name of the section and we name it without short grid. We press OK. We go again, we right click and we choose to add a new design section. This new design section is a copy of the previous one. We once again edit the name and we name it with short grid. Now we go to this new design section and we choose to delete stage 1 with excavation. Next we go to the properties tab and we press the edit wall section button. We choose to add a new wall section and we name it short grid. This will be a diaphragm wall and here we edit the short grid properties. We change the short grid width to 0 0.15 meters and we press OK. Next we go to the design tab. And here we choose to use US allowable settings. And for the member codes we choose to use US steels. Once again we go to the edit wall properties. We choose the short grid. We go to the tab concrete rebars. And we change the short grid reinforcement. We choose to use for top and bottom 5 rebars number 5. We choose for concrete material FC3 KSI and grade 60 steel. And we press OK. Now we are ready to go on with our excavation. We go to the model tab and we press to add a new construction stage to the model. We press yes and here we can see that a new stage is added. In this construction stage we choose to excavate to the elevation 128.35 meters. Once again we choose to add a new stage and in this construction stage we choose to draw a left wall beam. We click on the wall and here we choose to position the element on the right side of the main wall. Here we change the new walls section and we put it to short grid. And we press OK. Next, uh, we go again to the model tab, we add a new construction stage, and we excavate to the elevation 126.8 meters. We add the last stage and in this stage we also draw a wall beam. We once again choose to position it in the right side of the main wall and we change the wall beam section to short grid. We press OK and now we're ready to go on with the calculation. 
you will press the calculate all design sections button on the bottom right side of the program and when the calculation is exceeded we can see uh, various results and checks in the analysis and checking summary page we can see graphically the results in the results tab of DPEX-CAV here we can graphically see results for its construction stage and its design section we can see the wall moment with a moment capacity for several states and for the two design sections we can see walls here with the shear capacity we can see the wall deflection with minimum and maximum values and also we, we can see the soil horizontal stresses the total vertical stresses and the effective vertical stresses thank you for watching this video visit our webpage in order to download a free trial version of our software program and please feel free to contact us